Hello everyone. Today I will discuss assignment 9 for the course Fuzzy Set Logic and System and Application. In this assignment, basically, there are three types of questions are given and from question 1 to 8 are of similar type. Question 9 and 10 are of different type. So we are given a discourse capital X and for continuous and discrete set uh, we are having this formula. So in this assignment basically the term two term are more important linguistic variable and linguistic term right. So a linguistic variable have various linguistic term and after that what term are used according to that we have to uh, find out the solution right. Uh, the first term is linguistic term in a linguistic variable vary or two when this term will be there then what we have to do we have to square the uh, we have to square the membership value term we have to square the value of membership term right or value in the same case when the we are giving with the linguistic term more and less in that case what we have to do we have to square root of the membership value for a particular element which are available in the fuzzy set right so there are two term first one is the very and two if this term will be there then we have to the we have to square the membership value of that particular element uh, available in that fuzzy set if the term linguistic term more or less will be used then we have to square root uh, of that particular membership value present uh, in that universe of discourse for a particular fuzzy element or fuzzy sets. Now next when the term will be given very very bright right when very and very bright it means very is uh, used to twice so when very will be used twice then we have to uh, multiply membership value of that particular element four times right four times and in the next session when the very term is used thrice right then we have to multiply it eight times right so each very reflected a power of two so when very will be used three times then it represent that we have to multiply the membership value two raised to the power three that is eight times right when very will be used two twice then what we have to do then 2 raised to the power 2 that is 4 so we have to multiply membership value of that particular element four times so just we have to use this fundamental concept from question 8 1 to 8 <clears throat> so question 1 so we are given a universe of discourse 1 to 8 and this is the fuzzy set uh, heavy and each element having their membership value. Now question one, uh, what will be the membership value very heavy, right? Very heavy uh, for the generic variable three, right? So generic variable in this is three and uh, what we have to do? Just we have to uh, square of this membership value and square of this membership value will be 0.25. So correct answer is B. Next question, same question, very heavy but uh, now this time we have to find out the generic variable value of 7 right 7 so in this case this is our element 7 and when we will square of this membership value then it will come again 1 so correct option is a question number 3 same question but right now we have to find out the very heavy at generic variable value 8 so in this case 8 so it having the membership value 0 0.5 when we will square it then again it will comes out to be 0.25 that is option C is correct question number four uh, for the same very heavy and generic variable one so in one we having the membership value that is 0 0.1 when we have we will square it then it comes out 0 0.01 so option uh, B is the correct option question five now uh, what will be the membership value for very very heavy right very very heavy so very is used twice so 2 raised to the power 2 that is 4 so now we have to multiply 4 times uh, 4 times with the that particular membership value and uh, question is being asked at generic variable value of 1 6 right 6 so 6 having the membership value 0.9 and we have to multiply it 0 0.9 0 0.9 0 0.9 0 0.9 and this comes out to be 0 0.6561 so correct answer is C 
and this is the formula question number six in this uh, we have to find out the generic variable value of three right and three having the membership value 0.5 so 0.5 multiply by four times then it comes out to be 0.0625 that is option a is correct one question number seven same question but uh, what we have to find a generic variable value of four so four four having the membership value 0.7 multiply uh, it with 0.7 multiply by 0.7 four, uh, four times so final answer will be equal to 0.2401 so option b is the correct one question number eight what will be the generic variable value of five right five so five this 0.8 so just multiply four times 0 0.8 0 0.8 0 0.8 0 0.8 so it comes out to be um, 0 0.4096 so option c will be the correct one don't multiply four multiply 0 0.8 right we have to multiply 0 0.8 four times right so if we'll if you do this four into this then it will come equal to 0 0.32 so there is no such option available but uh, you do, you don't have to follow this this is totally wrong we have to multiply 0 0.8 0 0.8 0 0.8 0 0.8 four times right so this is clearly mentioned that you have to uh, multiply uh, that particular membership value four times question nine this is the fundamental concept uh, fundamental concept right so concentration and dilation there are two term concentration when we are going to produce one more fuzzy set and uh, depend upon the value of k if k greater than one then new fuzzy set will be created and this is the part of the concentration and uh, dilation when value of k less than one then this there will be in this case k must be greater than one then uh, it will be uh, concentration and when k will be less than one then it will be the case of dilation so normally in the case of uh, concentration k is equal to 2 so in this particular case what we have to do just we have to square of that particular fuzzy set membership value for continuous and for discrete so question number nine uh, let a is the fuzzy set defined in the universe of discourse one two three four and this is finally fuzzy set a so just what we have to do just uh, we have to multiply uh, that particular membership value again with itself that is 0 0.2 0 0.04 0 0.4 0 0.16 1 again it's 1 and 0 0.5 again it's 0.25 so this will be the correct answer that is option b this one is the correct answer so for the case of uh, uh, concentration uh, k value will be equal to uh, normally it will be equal to 2 right <coughs> K equal to 2 not greater than 2 but must be greater than 1 question number 10 for the case of dilation so I already discussed to you dilation case will be occur when K less than 1 so normally uh, it will be preferred K must be equal to K equal to 0.5 so in this case just we have to take the square root of that particular membership value so same question one two three four and in the fuzzy set this so square root of point two that it will be come to point four four this and point two that is point four in this case it will be equal to point six three three two one again square root of one one point five square root is equal to point seven zero again option a is the correct one so this is the final solution and if there is any discrepancy let me know so that we can rectify and update the solution uh, accordingly so thank you so much and uh, in recent past five assignment uh, we are having 100 percent accuracy and most probably this one also so thank you so much next assignment will be updated within one to two, day, two days because uh, on 26th of march i have my two exam python for data science and soft computing that's why i unable to update so but uh, further order assignment i will update uh, as soon as it will be released thank you so much